All right, here's an update to the project I did a while back. Um, I'd done a video recently about the projector coming down and the screen and all that nice stuff. We just added some light controls and some uh, some custom key keypads here. So we've got our control four system here that does the uh, on focus. There we go. That does our projector. We got satellite screen comes down. We go back to our control system. We got our lights. Now we have our we have our table lights, our sink lights. We have patio, barbecue, fans, Evo lights, oven, and then outdoor restroom. Yes, even the restrooms got lights. So all our lights now are automated. Oh, I think I forgot to click on these guys. There we go. So all these guys are automated. You can control them all through the app. Nice thing about these, um, again, Control 4 does a really good job on on uh, ease of use. Um, easy to program, easy to work. We've got Jose here and Alex messing around. And these are uh, keypads. They're actually fan switches, but we took off uh, these functions here, these three, and we set up a uh, all off uh, projector on and lights on function. So you click on the bottom one, it turns the fan off. You click on the top one, it turns the fan on. You push the middle one and it turns the projector on. So, yeah, this isn't finished yet. This hole was way bigger than than uh, than is needed. So they're gonna they're gonna finish this hole up and put a faceplate on it. So the nice function here is you do an all off and literally everything turns off. All our fans, our lights, our projector hides, our screen goes up. So everything's managed through here. Your little tablet. Through the switch that's there on the door on, on the wall, and also here. So here I've got I've got another fan controller for my fans, but I took off the functions from the three middle ones, and um, we did a Pandora function, and then a volume up and a volume down. So volume up, volume down, and then Pandora, and then fan on, fan off. So this just adds another little custom touch to uh, to the project. It's a pretty cool little setup. Um, we've got all our controls. It's not usually the way we do it, but we've got all our fan controls, our, our light controls in here. We've got a Zigbee signal that goes all the way from inside the house and controls all the, the switches. Like I said, it uh, everything's controlled through control four. All the lights out here are controlled by control four. I right, push uh, push the projector one. Push the middle one, Jose. So the projector comes down, the screen comes down. But yeah, we also redid the head end. Alex did the the bulk of the work. And um, took down Two shelves, and all the shelves were full of, of uh, all the equipment. Wires were just dangling, um, and we ended up doing a wall-mounted, hinged, 18 space or 16 space rack. There you go. It's a, a lot cleaner now. It's again. On the wall, it's hinge. You mind opening? I'll give you a little demo on how it works. It looks. So that's uh, that's a way. Obviously, you open it from the front. That's can we do the hinge? Let me show how that works. 
So there's a key back there. So you can service it from the back. And those panels actually come off also. So you can remove the side panels and access the, the rack from the sides if you need to. We also did the door bird door station. I'm going to put the tablet right there. This guy. So we did the door bird door station with the app. So you can see the uh, on the keypad or the control pad here. You can see what's going on the front door. Answer it. It acts just like an intercom, and it also gives the the ding dong function for the front or for the entire house. It's a pretty cool system. You guys are saying goodbye because they're gonna take off. And so am I. So.